Fog Entertainment back with another video and this is going to be What If August Marks Kilt T.O. and Rat Boy. And I say August Marks, it's more or less Marks Incorporated or whatever, whatever he called his wee gang after Pope, Pope Enterprises and then it went to Marks Incorporated or Marks Enterprises, whatever. You know what I'm on about. Marks is wee pal Moses Cartwright as seen here. Recently uh, watching Sons here, I'm on episode 10 of season 7 and obviously this is the episode where it goes down. We are in the aftermath of uh, Bobby's just been tortured. Of course, they get the preacher's family, all that information in the body. And then uh, Mark's basically, to prove a point to Jax, kills Bobby and is like, don't you ever cross me again, Jackson. And then the episode ends, of course, with um, Sam Crow getting August Mark's arrested. And then that leads Sam Crow into plotting a plan where they get Tio um, finged. Essentially, they get him like pretend kidnapped by Mark, so he gives up the location of where the sons are at. Because, of course, that's what Moses Cartwright's crew, Blackwater, Riz, and me. They're going to go and take out the sons, right? So that happens. Um, but the only thing is, Rat Boy is there with T.O. They get the information because T.O. is not going to give up his eye, which I think is a pretty foul thing. Like, why, why would he be so loyal to. Um... I mean, it's a different Rat Boy, but. Tio's not even in the club. He's a grim bastard. You know, it's a weird one. It's like... I mean, say this was legit. You wouldn't really expect him to go through with this, in my opinion. But, of course, to send the location where the, it's the neo-Nazis hideout and then the Nazis and Sam Crow and some grim bastards wipe out all of uh, Marx's crew and uh, then Jax and the gang torture Cartwright and then Jax shoots him in the dome. But this video here today is what if Marx killed Tio and Ratboy? Because I think it's a very realistic possibility. It's like, you've killed Bobby, he's then got you arrested, so Moses is in charge of this whole operation. Uh, Tyler tells him to go pick up Tio because he'll know information. They go do that. They actually manage to get Ratboy at the same time. They then torture them for information, well, a couple of punches and a beat down. You know, no, no limbs or uh, eyes were lost in the, the making of this torture, so to speak. But then, like, after he gives up the location, they're just left there with Tyler. Now, you can clearly see that August Marks doesn't really trust Tyler. He's like, hmm, you've been, you've been close with the, with the MC for over a decade. Oh, that shite. So it's like, hmm. So, why... Is he being left alone here? And also, like, why wouldn't Moses just drop both of them? There's literally no need to keep them alive. Especially Ratboy, because he didn't give him any information. And also, killing Ratboy weakens the sun. So, this video is, what if Ratboy and T.U. died? Would an awful lot change? I'm looking at it. Probably not. The sons would be doing the member and would lose a president in the MC world. Would never have that moment of where they patch in Tio, so that would be pretty shit. And I doubt they would have patched in any of the Grim Bastards, because I, I just think they were up to Sam Crow's level, to be honest. Tio himself even said that. Stick is a bit unpredictable, so to speak. Um, so yeah, that's what would have happened. I think things would have played on as normal. But, y you know, probably would have evened the playing field. But then I guess, by the time Sam Crow even extracted revenge, they'd have been 3 0 done. Bobby, Ratboy, and Tio. You know, so if you're good from that point of view, I don't know, but that's uh, this wee theory here about sons. What if August Marx's crew killed Tio and Ratboy? I like talking about this show because I fucking love it. It's the best thing in the world, man. Doesn't it get better than SOA? It's fucking Disney. It's Disney, guys. That's Fog Entertainment. We're back.